Hey everybody, um, I have a mini album to show you. I haven't done a mini album in a while. I've been working on um, scrapbook layouts instead. But um, I have a shelf at work that I wanted to um, put some photos on. So this was a good way to do it. Um, I decided to kind of go with, um, I guess it's a little bit steampunky. I don't know. <laughs> um, I just thought, okay, metal. I want to put a bunch of metal on it. So um, that's what I decided to do. Um, this one has chipboard and stuff all underneath. And then I put the aluminum um, ducting tape over the top of it, just painted it a bunch of different colors, used a lot of gears, um, Tim Holtz clocks, uh, book plates. Um, I've got just more gears and keys and a lot of Tim Holtz product in here. Uh, yep. I painted it with a bunch of different colors and just kept going around and around and around until I got the colors where I like it. Um, the back of it, I just did the crackle paint in similar colors. Oh, the whole album too is actually the grunge board. From, there's a lot of Tim Holtz in here actually, now that I think about it. Um, anyway, so here's the first page. The paper line I used for this is um, Tattered Time by Die Cuts with a View. Um, I might actually put some journaling or something here at some point, but I'm not completely sure. So this is the first page, um, more gears, the Scrabble tile letters. Um, I also used the Tim Holtz um, rub-ons in here. Tried to keep um, most of the album fairly cohesive. This is um, some type of washi tape. I have these really old um, buttons and things like that that are actually pronged. They're like this, and they have prongs on them. I don't know if you can see them, but um, I think I don't remember who used to make those. Anyway, they're pretty old, and so I just beat down the backs of them and made them look like metal buttons. Here again is the uh, tiny rub-ons, clocks, anything metal I could find I pretty much incorporated into this album. I just trust all the edges too of the paper when I was gluing the paper down. These were also really old. Um, I don't know where they're from, they're actually brads, but I took the backs off of them. Um, more Tim Holtz with the clock die cut and the gears die cuts. Those are the brads that look like screws or, yeah, screws. Um, the floor delays I got at Michael's. Had them for a while and just decided to use them in here. A lot of washi tape. Used just some of the round um, You know, for, they use them for jewelry most of the time, but this is a stamp that I cut out that looks like chain. Here's a, another clock piece. That one's Heidi Swap. And then there's your back forever. Um, this one I actually got some little cog pieces too. You can't really see them on here, huh? but uh, I ordered those and put those in as well. page with the keys and those were from those little white tags were for making memories I believe they're kind of older too this one I also used a stamp that looks like a nut just more of the same a lot of metal in here Again, I put all the little gears and gadgets in there. Another heart. It's all steampunky looking. This one I just did the clock and then put the the screw brads. More two hooks rub ons. Things for the most.
those parts. And just another steampunky looking heart. Anyway, that's the whole album. Thanks for watching.